interesting live video. Let's see. Hello, Jambosana. Hi to everybody on Facebook. Hello if you're watching this on Catch Up on YouTube. Very nice to be back with you. Just saying to our friends here on Instagram that uh, if you follow my Instagram stories, you would have seen that yesterday I posted some pictures traveling back from the coast in Kenya, which is very sort of beachy Caribbean vibe. Uh, through Nairobi, which is the big city, and now up in an area called Laikipia, which is really in the heart of Kenya. And behind me, I've just had to pull the curtain because it's so bright, uh, is Mount Kenya. I saw it first thing this morning. It's snow-capped peak, just peeking out of the clouds. It's now covered in clouds. It's quite cloudy here. It's very bright, but it's, um, but it's cloudy and it's very warm, which is just as well because I am in my exercise gear for a good reason. It's a bit of fitness Thursday, so a little bit different. We're going to be doing something physical rather than mental, but actually it's going to connect the two. Have you heard of this amazing practice called Qigong? That's what we're going to be talking about today with one of my favourite guests, and I know you absolutely love her too, Katie Brendel. She of the amazing Gua Sha facial routine, which we've talked about before. I've got my Gua Sha's here, which I was doing uh, this morning. I woke up feeling a little bit puffy. So this was so good. Have you got your gua sha? Now we do have a Liz Loves, obviously, with our special guest. So we've got 20% of everything that Katie's going to be talking about. So whether we're talking about gua sha or whether we're talking about a newer initiative that she's doing called Qigong, which she started promoting really more during lockdown. And it's this amazing, amazing practice. And it just sort of brings together mind and body. It's fantastic for relaxation, for energy, for stress. All good. Oh, hi, Katie, you're there. Excellent, very nice to have you with me. I shall be clicking on you in just one second. Yeah, lots of people already saying that they've, they know about Qigong. They've done it before, they've tried it. So Katie has an amazing online course that you can sign up for with our 20% Liz Loves discount. So you can try it for a month, see how you get on with it. So let us see whether Katie, I hope the connection is going to work. Let's find you, Katie, Katie, here we go. Beaming intercontinentally, is that a word? Yeah, I think it is, intercontinentally across the continents. Hi, Katie. Hello. Hello. How are you? I'm super well. Look at you looking gorgeous and radiant. Where are you? Uh, oh, I'm just in my bathroom, which is where <laughs> I always am. I'm just going to put the, uh, the stand up a bit. There's nothing glamorous about my life, Liz. It's basically my brand was started in my bathroom purely because that's the only place I've got any remote chance of getting peace and quiet in this house. So I know the <laughs> feeling. What happens. Yeah, lock on bathroom door, number one essential for child rearing. <laughs> Get yourself a bit of Absolutely, space. Absolutely, it is. It definitely is. <laughs> now, last time, how's Kenya? Kenya is great. Kenya is super fab, super chilled. Um, I'm in my family home. I've connected with my eldest son. I've seen lots of old friends. It's just, it's great. I haven't been here for two years, obviously, for mm. all sorts of uh, unmentionable reasons. But yes, almost back to normal, which is really, really good. Oh, so. how lovely. Well, you're looking really well. Well, thank you. I have, uh, I went for a, a quick run this morning, uh, had a good night's sleep, which always helps. And I'm super excited to talk about this because I did actually do my gua sha this morning. Last time you were with us, we were doing this, mm. weren't we? Which I love. And also this little thing has been genius for me. This little one that Ooh, I use on my, so I use it on my eye bag. So it's wonderfully cold. And when I wake up with puffy mm. eyes, I just kind of do it like this and under here and literally I can see the bags go down it's amazing it is brilliant and you know you can slightly move it to the rounded edge just yeah show that. me um, show me show me I've just got a jade one here so it's that the very it's got a very fine rounded edge just here yeah and that is once you've done the pressing that you've been doing yeah then you can obviously with oil I've just I've, I've actually just put makeup on so I'm sort of feeling fairly slack in my skin um you can do very mini gua sha like this Ooh and like this and it's brilliant for that hooded eye yeah, and yeah, also yeah. for eye bags and crow's feet how interesting i do love it it's and it feels a... it feels great on the skin this cooling oh, yeah. and you can almost feel the energy i know we're going to be talking about energies but you can feel this rose quartz there's something kind of special that it kind of emits it's just you want to hold it it's, you want to keep it close to well, you well 
Well, it is, it is, it is the lover's crystal, isn't it? But it, it's also the thing is, these crystals are really good quality ones. It's like everything in life. If you're, you know, the, 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 the market gets flooded, and I understand that. But the problem is to make them that cheap, there's going to be compromises. There, sure. there will be. And one of the first things that they do is they slather the boulders in chemicals before they start cutting them no. to, to minimize breakage. So then immediately all the crystal benefits have gone, gone, straight away, done. So you're wasting your money. Um, and then the other thing that they do is they take the, the kind of the leftovers from when we make the right, the proper ones, grind it into a powder and then basically make glass, um, but call it a crystal because technically it kind of is, except there's no resonance to that. So what you're picking up yeah. on on these is that you pick them up and they've got a frequency. Yeah. They have. Yeah, yeah. Because they're properly made. Feel it. Love yeah. them, love them. Well, thank you. Thank you for our discounts. I know lots and lots of people have been snapping these up. And I have to say, I was so pleased that I put them in my bag and they take up no space and they're just coming with me everywhere now. So thank you. Oh, I'm so happy now. <laughs> well, so have you got a tapper though, Liz? What's, oh, I haven't got my tapper Have here. you got a tapper though? I, 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 I need to bring my... My, 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 my ex is coming out with my youngest for half term. So maybe I need to get him, send him a message and say, bring my tapper. He needs to bring this out with you because this is okay. now what we're talking about today is, is, is the deeper so this is the uh, this is the tip of the iceberg okay, okay. today is the iceberg because when we're talking about health and well-being of you know we, we want to get into the body as as you well know you were talking about this like you know before anybody else but the reality is is you do not look your best if you do not feel your best sure. that is a fact that everyone will resonate to um and this was really where the qigong kind of came out of this because I never I never expected to make a Qigong platform. That was never my intention. My intention was to get these products out there because I knew that they worked. And I thought, yeah. well, that's already quite a lot. And then what happened in lockdown was that sort of horrible feeling as, a, as an Eastern practitioner whereby, you know, all these amazing Western doctors were, you know, the heroes of the NHS. And you're sitting and thinking, oh, well, I want to do something. I want to help. I don't want to be sat at home. Yeah. Um, I want to do something. So it all I did was just, and this is by the way when Joe Wicks was going, like everyone was like doing it, millions of people. And there's me on Instagram going, anybody want to do Qigong? And there was five of us on the first day. And it just grew and it grew and it grew and it grew. And the appetite within our kind of age group and demographic of, of women yeah. um, in their second springs and sort of around that age point yeah. um, was just unprecedented. I never in a million years ever thought anything would it would be anything beyond me just doing something live on Instagram in lockdown. And here we all are. <laughs> so you've created this whole new platform. It's, you know, it's, it's another, it's called Hey You Fit, isn't it? Rather than mm. Hey You, which is the gua sha. They're the products. These yeah. are the products. Yeah. So Hey, hey You Method Fit is, all the... is the active bit. Yes, it's the Qigong bit. So really what the, the, what's now happened, so I just put my tapper down, is that once upon a time before all of this happened, I was, I'm, I'm a fully qualified Chinese doctor kind of practicing. And I just sat right. there at the end of what, another session just thinking, God, oh, there's got to be a better way of getting this extraordinary information, mm. which is over here, like, like, like Tutankhamun's cave of wonders <laughs> over here that most people in the West don't really know much about to this massive group of people over here that are suffering. And, and here I am in the middle charging 50 quid an hour, one by one, I go, God, this is bonkers. So I thought, there's got to be a way of getting this connected. So yeah. what then happened was you got me at the front sort of as, as the practitioner going, okay, this is what you need to do to look after yourself. This is my training and my understanding. And then what you need to do is you apply these one minute techniques, which is all the tools on the Hey You Method, like gua sha or tapping or body combing or body gua sha. They're just one minute, they're easy. And yeah. you've yourself said they, they, they popped in your handbag, they've come to Kenya, you're still doing it. Yeah, yeah. They're not a hassle, it's not two hours. And then the other part of what I was teaching people to do were the techniques. Um, movement, because movement is medicine. Um, and the problem that we've had as sort of ladies born in the sort of second half of the 20th century, now and now sort of maturing in the 21st century, mm -hmm. is that we keep applying to our bodies this age-old formula of calories in versus calories out. Yeah. And it's not true. No, and and the more work. to menopause we go or come out... Sorry. doesn't work. <laughs> It doesn't work. It's, it, it's, I was, funny enough, I was doing a Bar Z this morning and I said to the lady, it's like we're at maths 
and we're looking, we're, we're telling the teacher um, how to do the volume of a Toblerone box, right? Do you remember all that? And, and yet we're using a round tree cylinder. And we're going, well, it doesn't work. Because I'm like, no, of course it doesn't, because you're applying the round tree cylinder formula to the Toblerone box. So they're the different formulas. The thing is, is that when we get middle age spread or body issues or aches and pains or low mm. energy or bad mm. sleep or thinning hair or menopause symptoms, the reality is, is that there's three key things going on with the body that we need to understand. And the minute, and none of them apply to calories in versus calories out. Yeah. The, the, these are the three things that, that Qigong is all based on. One is that the qi, and, which is the energy, and the blood of the body have to flow smoothly for you right. to be healthy. And Gua Sha picks up on that because it's mm -hmm. moving the flow. Okay. Exactly, right. The second is that your cells are constantly releasing toxicity and imbuing fresh life force, oxygen, and nutrients second by second and if that doesn't happen you start to feel sluggish or then you yeah. start to get kind of aches and pains and things rumbling and the reality is is that modern living is stopping those first two things from happening we we kind of vaguely think yeah that makes sense but modern life stops it we're over sedentary and we're over stressed and then the yeah. final thing people don't even know about which is for your body to be healthy you have to strengthen the five key organs of the body and that's so this formula of sort of Western exercise of calories in, calories out, burning 400 calories and all this doesn't work because it's not, it might move the chi and blood, but what it's doing is it's straining the organs whilst you're bringing the nutrients into them. Oh. Whereas when you do slow exercise like Qigong, you're relaxing the organs and giving them time to imbue all this lovely fresh energy and life force that you're bringing in, thus strengthening the whole of the body and then you get into shape. So is Qigong this sort of amazingly slow, fluid motion, a bit like Tai Chi that you see all these amazing people in the Far East doing first thing in the morning in parks and open spaces? Mm, well, it's a really good question because, of course, there's different sorts of Qigong, ju just like yoga. So w it, when you enter into the yoga world, there's Hatha and there's Vinyasa and there's Bikram and then there's all sorts of millions of other things. Um, Qigong's the same, but what we've done on the platform is that we've created... Um, a very simple formula for you to work out which Qigong is right for you, okay? Right. Because there's different styles. So we've divided it into boost, build, and be. So boost is the dynamic Qigong, which is which is based on what we call the animals, because it's very like, <laughs> kind of like, you don't make those noises, but it's kind of, just kind of a dramatic effect. But it's very much that kind of like power Qigong, okay? Right. Um, and that's very good for people that like that kind of worked out feeling that they want to feel that they move their body intensely um then you've got the build which is many women who are um in menopause situations or exhausted by the overwhelm of our, our lives that we yeah. get to our exercise that oh i haven't got the energy for that i'm so sure. tired so for these people we have build which is slightly slower it's more like what you'll see in the parks these lovely sort of slow considered movements which basically are working on the energy fields of the body as well as the musculoskeletal system and all the organs and then finally we have the b section now the b section is very much more the sedentary qigong aimed for people who've got limited mobility perhaps you've right. just had covid and you're feeling absolutely walloped and you you yeah. can't even stand up you're just so tired Gosh. um if you need to be bringing more meditation into your day if you're like my dad who's 84 he does all the b stuff really? it's very much slower and calmer amazing and once you're on the platform can you choose between the two i mean i know there are certain days when i want to just be and i need to get that mental headspace but there are other mornings when actually i want to kind of get going can i, I mix and match oh yeah so the idea is that we're the, the idea of the planner is for you to, because people are new to Qigong. Um, yeah. well, one, people are new to it, they don't know what it is. And two, as somebody who's been born and lived through the, 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 the yoga revolution, one thing that I wanted, to, I mean, I think yoga's great, but mm -hmm. one of my problems with it is that I get very confused as to what yoga's for me, like which one should I be doing? And then yeah. I think I'm doing the right thing and then someone contradicts it. And I'm like, oh, no, I'm confused again. So yes. what we wanted to do with Qigong was to just make it really simple and go, right, so we will give you what we think will be right, but somebody like you would be able to transcend through all the different classes, mm. okay, because, and I could see that would happen. So what you get uh, is it's a £40 monthly subscription for which you get 25 classes a week, which is a lot, and it covers Gosh. all of the different aspects. So and you can just come in and out of any and how, of the classes And how, how, how long is a class? 
It depends. Um, the Some of the classes are 30 minutes. We are adding in 15-minute classes in a couple of weeks as well, so there's be extra ones coming in. Um, most of them are 45, and then what yeah. we do is the physical class is 45 minutes, and then we add 15 minutes meditation at the end. Nice. So that those people that have to you know, rush off and get back to their desks and things. You yeah. know, we always say, look, you really should do the meditation. It's the best bit. But yeah. if you really can't, then the class is 45 minutes and then you can just skip that last bit. Um, and my class is an hour because I can't stop talking. <laughs> <laughs> and so is this live then? You have a, show, a timetable and people can join live or is it like pre-recorded and yeah. you can just tune in whenever you like? Well, it's both. Um, so most of the classes are delivered live because we, we're, because energy changes every single day and no two days are alike in a 60-year circuit. So that's how energy moves. It's a 60-year cycle. 60-year no cycle? I had no idea. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's just to explain that one. It's because there are 12 Chinese zodiac animals. It's relevant because it's year of the tiger. We just moved. So you have 12 Chinese zodiac animals. So it's a, se it's a sequence of each year you have a new animal. So there's 12 of them. So they rotate in 12. But then they're also rotating to the five elements, which is fire, earth, metal, water, and wood. Excuse me. <coughs> so what happens is um, you've got the power of 12 times the power of five. So one year, for example, we're in the Yang water tiger now. <coughs> so that's a water tiger. And in 12 years' time, when the tiger comes back round, it will be a wood tiger. And 12 years after that, it will be a fire tiger. So it goes round this 60-year this circuit. Wow. <coughs> Which basically, not sorry, I've got the tickle. Nuts and bolts mean, Liz, no two days are the same. No two days are <laughs> so the same, So to answer your yeah. question... I know, no one realizes this, and no years are the same. This is what's so wonderful about understanding Chinese astrology, because you start to understand that time suddenly becomes terribly precious, because you're never going to experience this day ever again. And this year will never be the same, because it will be a different animal. That's, that's a so really good lesson, um, isn't it, for, for all of us who don't tend to live in the moment. I'm very guilty of that. I live in the future. I'm always about the next deadline, the next thing, the next thing, and actually forget to be present and just here enjoying this special moment, which, as you say, will never come back. So we, mm. we, need, we need to live it, don't we? We need to live in the moment. Mm. Well, and these classes that we offer tie into that because we're constantly replenishing that thought because we know that, and you're absolutely right. The, the, the trick is then to actually remember it later on this afternoon or yeah. tomorrow morning when we get whipped back up. And the great thing about practicing with us is that we're, we're constantly refeeding that back to you. So we would have made you think about that today. And then you come back to, say, a meditation class tomorrow, something completely different. Mm. And you'll be reminded of that because we're constantly saying, well, it's this, it's that. We're in the spring zone or if you're in the southern hemisphere, it's that. It's a different moon. It's a different animal. It's, it's a yang day. There's different things happening wow. every day. So most of the classes are indeed live. A few of them are not. Um, yeah. We have uh, a pre-record which goes up at 5 a.m funnily enough that's not live uh that's the half hour class because i thought there's many people that have to get up really early they yes. just want to do the half hour and they've got to go um so funnily enough none of the teachers wanted to teach at five o'clock every day and i don't blame them i don't <laughs> um so that's a pre-record um aaron's who's one of our senior instructors he's a pre-recorded uh just purely because he's, he lives in bath and little did we realize that the network in bath is really bad it's not so good i'm i'm not far from bath and i can definitely vouch for that so these pre-records these are the ones that you can log on to at any time can you to suit you yes all all classes you log on at any time once um you either do them live okay um or you just click on them like netflix and so you go oh, oh i'm going to do manuela's heaven and earth course okay so just just a little bit of um logistics here if anybody wants to check it out i'll give you the website address and your liz loves all in capitals all one word gets you 20 percent off your first month subscription so you can give it a go give it a go and try i always think february is a great month yes. to refresh Everyone thinks about January resolutions and New Year, New You and all that baloney. But actually, I find it very hard after all the festivities and the kind of come down. And it just kind of crashes and burns for me in January. Whereas I get into February and I'm thinking, right, it's the beginning of the year. I've got all that stuff out of the way. And I'm now ready to think about spring around the corner. And, and for me, February is always a kind of a month of change and moving on. Oh, that's so interesting because you're clearly, well, of course, so connected because 
um, the new year actually starts in February. That's the point, is that because of the mess up with, with kind of, you know, ancient Rome and all the stuff that's happened, we've removed ourselves from the natural calendar, which is what ah. the Chinese New Year is. It's nothing specific. Yeah. The new really? year. So I'm in, very uh, in tune with the Earth's energies and mm. vibrations. Is that right? Yeah, of course. Well, I mean, of course you are. But yes, I mean, you don't need to tell you that. But yes, you, you absolutely are. Oh, amazing. Something I that I've that. made... It, well, it's really interesting because the new year the new year start came in on uh, Tuesday, yes. and then the tiger animal comes in to the first day of spring, which is tomorrow. So what you're feeling Ooh. is spring, yes. and that's when the new year starts. It goes into the spring energy when suddenly you wake up, you come out five days, and you go, "Oh, what's going yeah. on?" You know, whereas January, forget it. January in the natural mm. calendar is the end. It's the most quiet time of the year it is when the ground is at its coldest and the water element which is the element in charge at winter time um is freezing into the ground so what you should be doing in january is nothing i mean Good. i've been comatose for the last <laughs> I couldn't do it because I, we are, and, and the problem is, you know, we make all these decisions and resolutions and all that, and then, you know, we fail so often we do, and and then we get depressed and demotivated. Whereas if we kind of switch that in our heads and think, right now, we're entering the new year. Now is the time to do something special and different. Yeah. This is the time. And also, this interestingly, because it's a tiger year, really, so it's slightly going off piece. Of so, so what does that mean, so being a tiger, tiger year? year Oh, well, so, well, specifically, it's a Yang Water Tiger year. Um, and now that means that this okay. is the first time in 60 years um, that we're in this year. So if you know anyone that's 60 or over, they've experienced it. My husband's a Yang Water Tiger. Mm. So we're not going to, it's unlikely we will experience another one in our lifetimes. I mean, I don't plan to live till I'm 110, thanks. But so what that means is the tiger is is very much about um, the wood element. Um, she's a wood She's a wood creature. Think of the stripes and the trees and things. And she is very creative. And the wood female is a very creative energy because we create life. I mean, that we do. I don't want to be politically incorrect, but we do. Yeah. So therefore, the female has more creative energy. Now, when, that, when we hit our menopause, which is what we call the second spring, okay, and we're in spring now in a tiger year, it means any woman now who is unencumbered from the process of creating life, which in the olden days we would be doing, like periods equal pregnancy, now suddenly the body is going, all that creative energy goes inside ourselves. Mm -hmm. um, and you're in a very strong creative year. Wow. So this is the year for creative projects and taking on new things. 100%. Isn't that amazing? Uh, that's so empowering. Mm. So can you show me, I feel I that I've been, I'm, I'm sitting here in my yoga gear, well not yoga, in my kind of exercise gear, I feel that I should be doing something. Can can we do a little bit of Qigong? Because I know nothing yes, about it. I'm completely a novice. Where where would I start? How would I start this? Well, the easiest thing of all is I would suggest to anybody new to Qigong, just come to my class. She's, of course I'm going to say that. <laughs> because I'm really good at explaining kind of the basics. That's okay. kind of, my, that's what I guess why I'm there. I'm like, I'm like the doorman of the Cave of Wonders, you know. So let's just start now. So the easiest thing on anyone at home, just do this with me. The easiest way to start doing Qigong, okay, is to just shake. What, shake, shake our this hands? Is, what, shake, shake our bodies? Yeah, just shake. Let me just, I'm just going to put my camera down a tiny bit and I'm going to stand a bit further back. I'm okay, sure I, I, I might try standing up too. Right. Let's move my chair out of the way. So okay. All I'm doing is I'm shaking my arms, shaking my hands. Okay, shaking, you guys doing this? You so shaking? I'm doing like this with my feet. As if I was on a power plate. You know those power plates that we had in gyms? Yep. So it's kind of, that's it. So the way you're doing it there, just shaking like that, shaking like that, shaking the body. This is one of the most basic Qigong moves you can do. Now, of course, we go, it goes way more sophisticated than this, but this is the start. Feels lovely and loose, loosening up. That, that's, so what you're doing here is you're invigorating the energy or the life force inside your cells. Uh -huh. Because what happens when you start to feel sluggish is that that life force starts to go a bit flat. And it goes, it flatlines, and you feel that, you feel tired. Yeah. And the minute you do this, you're just waking the body back up again. You're feeling. So if you just stop there just for one second, just check back in. Can you feel a lovely sensation of relaxed yeah, yet yeah. energized? Yeah, totally. <sighs> I already that. feel so de-stressed. How's, how's everyone doing? What are the comments? Are you, are you feeling de-stressed? Yeah, everyone is really beginning to chill out. <laughs> so that's 
So that's just, just, just the beginning. Now, let's yeah. take three massive breaths, because the thing is, Liz, is that when you're practicing Qigong, you've got to let go and allow excretion through the breath and through the, the mouth and through the skin to come out of the body so that you can fill that your body back with new fresh life force coming in. Life force comes in from the breath. So mm -hmm. we have our thumbs on our index fingers like that, and we just bring a nice big breath in like this. And out. Getting to you frozen. So we're just breathing in. And what we're doing with that is we're just creating some space inside the body to breathe that energy in and let go. And now this is all tying into these simple practices of the free flow of chi and blood and purging and nourishing. And that metronome of breath is facilitating both those things to happen. So now with those two simple exercises. Okay, now your screen has frozen on me and I don't want to touch it in case I touch in case I click you off. So can you describe oh, no. can you what me? you're doing? Because I can't actually see you. Oh no! I can see your uh, lovely face, but I can't see the movement and I just don't dare touch it in case something happens. Okay, so let's just, I'll tell you what, we're going to take a loosely clenched fist like this. Can you see that? No, but I can lo loosely clench a fist, yeah? So loosely clench fist, and then what you're going to do is take your fists to your tummy mm -hmm. um, and go in a clockwise direction, just around your tummy. That's it. This is tapping. So that tapper I showed you yeah. that your son's going to bring out, yep. that's that's the tool, but you can do it just with your hands. I'm just going round in a clockwise direction around my middle. And is that going to help my these... digestion as well? Yes, because one of the key things, Liz, is that when we get stressed, which we do a lot, the body takes the blood supply away from the digestive system and puts it into the muscles for fight or flight. Oh. And that's one of the biggest reasons why we can't digest our food properly, why diets don't work, why we don't understand why we put weight on and yet we don't seem to eat very much. Um, so just drumming the tummy like this. And these, by the way, we're not even in the major moves yet. This is just basic Qigong warm-up stuff we're doing. Now I'm just drumming the sides of my waist. That's it, that's perfect. So what that is, is that's, the, that's harmonizing the spleen and the liver. Uh -huh. And just giving you a nice waist. Oh yes. Thank and then you. we're going to take those hands exactly where they are. And you're going to take them down the outside of your legs and then up the inside. So just go down. Yes. I do both legs at the same time. Okay. So you've got like one hand. That's it. All the way down to the feet. And then go over the toes. And then come all the way back up the middle on the insides of your legs. That's it, perfect. So what you're doing here is you're just invigorating the energy channels of the body. Just come That's up good. over the boobs. Don't drum the boobs, just come over them so that you're now on your chest. That's it. And now just drum your chest like Tarzan. Because what we're doing here is we're just invigorating the energy. Um, we're allowing any cells which have got really kind of ingrained negative frequencies kind of rumbling around they're just sort of lingering around from whatever happened in our past mm -hmm. and we're just drumming it to release it and now take that one of your hands and go down the inside of your arm drumming down the inside of one of your arms that's it and the other thing that you're doing with this tapping this is so important now take it up the outside of your arm that's it and over the shoulders is that when you're tapping you're actually invigorating. Then take your other hand now and go to the other side. So just repeat on the other side. This is feeling it's so tapping. good. I can't tell you. Well, you know. Well, it's, <laughs> it's, well when you get the tapper, you're gonna you're gonna really like kind of it takes it to a whole new level. Just drum it. That's it. And then take both hands now to the nape of your neck, and you're gonna just tap over here or the back, over the back of the head, oh. and then go to your fingertips and just tap down your face. Because the other thing that drumming does so brilliantly well is it energizes and engages with the stem cells deep in the marrow of your bones. And that is vitally important because the stem cells, as science is now starting to confirm, are like the elixir of youth. Totally. You know, you know my husband, he's just had stem cell injections on his knee. Um, and the Taoist masters knew all this, so they were using tapping as a way to energize these precious cells deep in the marrow of the bones, which are, they are like the font of youth, that is what they are, and it's really important to engage with them. So if you just 
relax for one second before we go any further. So those were just three really basic warm-up moves. How do you feel? I feel great. I feel calm. I feel energised. I feel loose. I feel, yeah, I feel invigorated, actually. Refreshed. Good. So have you got time for one more? And I'll do totally. an actual Qigong Qigong. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so I'll show you my favourite move. Can you see me okay now, Liz? I can't, darling. You, you've frozen, and I don't want to... Um, take you off I mean we could if you wanted you could leave and rejoin because that might potentially for me um, should we try that should we try it uh, and then hopefully yes. you won't be gone for good yeah if you if you click yes. off okay, and then request out, to, to join me again <laughs> meanwhile I can chat to everybody on Facebook who can't see the lovely Katie anyway how is it going on Facebook? Are you actually doing this now? Or are you just sort of watching with a cup of tea and a smile on your face? I hope that you've had a go. Uh, right, let's see whether... But, you know, so simple. Hey, so simple. And just easy. You don't even need tools. You can do it anytime, anywhere. So, Katie, there we go. So she's back again. Hopefully... Good. I'm glad that Instagram hasn't frozen. It's just here. Maybe it's just the maybe it's just Mount Kenya getting in the way of everything. <laughs> Let's I'm see. Back. Can you see me You're now? back. I can't see you yet, but hopefully. Uh, okay, guys on um, Instagram, can you see Katie? Let's see. I, yes, I can see you now. I think there's just a delay, I think, because we're, we're going through satellites. Now, it is still cycling, so I can still just see your face, but maybe, maybe it will give, I'm me, gonna say, give I'll, me the move. I'll stay close to the camera, Liz, okay? So what we'll do, we're, that, those moves were a very simple warm-up moves, oh, okay. um, which just allow you to start noticing your body, basically, but then we can start going into some specifics. So the move I'll teach you now is one of my favourites, which is the swimming dragon. And the Swimming Dragon is just an all-over body workout, which is fantastic. So you put your hands into prayer. Can you see that? Okay, yeah. And then you cross I can't, your arms I, I can't over. see you, darling, so you're going to have to just describe super well. Oh, and, yeah, and, and, okay. no, and, and, so and let me know if, if you're, I'm not you're doing, doing it right. <clears throat> okay, so draw your tummy in. That's perfect. And then what you're going to do is if you imagine you're in the King and I when you're seeing those Balinese dancers, um, and you're just going to point your fingertips to one of your sides. So don't go to your left, Okay. And just, that's it. And then just stretch your hands out away from you whilst putting your hip, your opposite hip in the opposite direction. That's it, perfect. And keep the tummy in and now turn your fingertips to go the other way as if you were creating a coil. Imagine that you were drawing like that. A, a corkscrew with your hands. Going that way. So that your hips are going, that's it. And then you're gonna bring your Ooh. hands back opposite again. That's so good so in the shoulders. Going. I can really feel that shoulder stretch. Yes, it's going to stretch the shoulder, uh -huh. that's it, and stretch the middle. Now, what you're going to do now is start pointing your fingertips ever so slightly down so that you're going to, you're, uh, f uh, pretend that you're drawing a giant corkscrew with your hands. Okay. That's it. And then you go from side to side, so that it's like a helter-skelter, okay? So ah. you're bending at the elbows. I'm trying to, gosh, it's really hot like to that, Like that, like that. You can't see them, like, what am I trying to say? That's it, you've got it. There you go. And then bring them up and then back and down then again. Down. So you're, you're up and then as you're going down, you're going in the opposite direction. So when you're down now, up and as if you're looping over yourself, but only miniature. And there you go, that's it, that's it, that's it. And then down and then the other way. And then can I reverse it that way? That's it, that's the way to do it, down. And then start bending at the knees, draw the tummy in. So you're actually going to draw this corkscrew all the way down to the ground, if you can. If anyone at home can't get to the ground, just stay within your torso area. The idea of Qigong, as I say to my ladies, it's not the Qigong Olympics, we're just, we, you know, we don't, we've not got nothing to prove here. We're just working with our bodies. Keep your tummy drawn in. Okay. Make sure that your hips are going to the opposite direction of your fingers so that you're creating like an S shape with what you're doing. That's it. And then you go slowly start to um, draw your S shape back up again. So eventually you're gonna go above your head. Ooh. Slowly, slowly, that's it. Until you go into complete prayer. So up onto tiptoes with your, as if you were in prayer. Mm -hmm. That's it, draw the tummy in, up onto the tiptoes, feel the energy through the legs, and then just pull your hands down, keep your thumbs crossed, pulling the arms down into prayer so that you're, you've got your hands in prayer still, coming in front of your heart coming down to your belly button, 
and then you're going to open your index fingers to each other and your thumb points to each other so you're creating like a diamond and you place that diamond over your belly button Lovely. that's it and that's that movement now it's I, it's quite hard to explain it. That's brilliant. No, well, I, I, hope, I hope I interpreted it correctly. I know Instagram can see you. I'm trying to do it so that everybody on Facebook and YouTube can get an idea. Obviously, you can go to Katie's platform as well and have a look properly. But that's so yeah. It, but you were doing it perfectly. Oh, thank you. Is that the sort of the, the usual starter movement? What did you call it? Something dragon. Um, it's called the swimming dragon. So this was one of my initial movements that I include. I include that every time I teach. It's such a good movement, especially for women. It's very good at balancing the fire and the water, which is the kidneys and the heart. And what we tend to find as ladies, especially in our second springs, which is the menopause, we tend to be too hot and our kidneys are absolutely annihilated right. by what's ha what we've done in our lives to, 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 to forge ahead with our equality that we now finally are starting to have. But we're like wounded soldiers, you know, we paid the price with our bodies without even realising we were even doing it. Yes. Um, and that particular exercise is extremely good at rebalancing the body and hydrating it back up again. Because most of us have got too much heat inside our bodies and we need to strengthen our kidneys. And what about the liver? Because that's such an important organ for detoxification. And, you know, particularly if we've been overdoing it with, you know, processed foods, sugary foods, high fats and, you know, the bad fats and alcohol. Can we kind of internally massage and support our livers through Qigong? Oh, yes. I mean, Qigong addresses every single organ in the body. And the Swimming Dragon move we were just doing, when, when you're really doing it, because that's a bit of an intro, you are massaging the liver. Um, that Amazing. particular move massages every single body organ. Wow. So in terms um, of overall health benefits, I mean, that's, that's staggering, isn't it, really? I mean, you know, forget oh, all gosh, the kind I of mean, the, all the structural stuff like flexibility and blood circulation and all of that, you know, to actually think about it on a deeper level, you're getting, it's so powerful, you're getting so much more out of the time that you spend moving rather than just sort of going well, for a brisk walk, you know, you're, you're really maximising your time. You really are, and this is why I love it so much, because the reality is if we go back to those three key principles of health, which they are, and if you've not got those three key principles on point, whatever else you're doing will not work as well as it could. It won't, because the body needs those three things. And Qigong addresses all three. So what you're, get, what you're getting is the old 20th century exercise sort of techniques was calories in versus calories out, right? Just go, like, face yourself and come out, and then you'll be okay. Um, and we've all learned that that clearly doesn't work. What Qigong does is it strengthens the body on the inside so that the body then reflects that with a sculpted contoured physique on the outside. So it's amazing at addressing being overweight or stubborn bits of fat that we don't really like really? with age spread. Yo, know, it I mean it works. I mean there's quite a lot of people on the platform at the moment going, it works, it works. I mean, we've got thousands of testimonies of the people that started with me at the beginning of lockdown. And to be honest, the intention of that was not to sort of, you know, get get anyone in sort of any particular sort of state of what they look like. It was to help people navigate the mental pressure of lockdown and just yeah. to get moving a bit because we were inside. Um, but the reality is, is that we've now got thousands of people who've come out the other side going, oh my God, I cannot believe what this has done for me because it addresses pain, it addresses inflammation, it strengthens the body systems, it works on all bodily systems, it's massively bringing energy into the body, which means you can cope. Qigong's yeah. been proven for mental health, for blood pressure, for osteoporosis, for menopause. I mean, these scientific studies are there. Just Google it. It's, I'm not like ad living this. This stuff's there. Yeah. So, you know, it's right there for everyone to do. I think the thing is, is that it's like this, this treasure trove of amazing Gosh. stuff that we just didn't seem to know. Yeah. And, and honestly, Liz, when I started studying Chinese medicine, that was, I kept thinking that the whole time. Going, what? How, how? How did I? Like, first of all, I'd yeah, go, wow, that's amazing. And then I'd go, how did I not know this? Why, why are we not talking about this? Where has Qigong been all my life? Why have I had to do all these hours in the gym punishing myself, having yeah. a miserable time, when I could have just been having a really great time doing doing this? And I do it every day, you know, and right. the platform is there. And I'm so proud of it because it will work on everybody. It doesn't matter That's what so your wonderful. exercise needs are, whether you want yeah. to do Barry's boot camp and Bikram yoga, or you're just getting over COVID and you can't get out of bed. It, everybody has been catered for in the platform. If you've got an hour, 15 minutes, we want to help you because it's so good and it works. So I'm good. so happy about it. Finally, something works. You know, something that, that uh, you know, I, I wasn't expecting it to be body sculpting. 
and helping with shape oh, yeah. and tone. You know, I thought maybe it would be good for my head, good for relaxation and for stretching. Um, but the fact that it can help change body shape is really interesting, you know, rather than doing oh, 300 really crunches does. in I the mean, gym. <laughs> I mean, mine, I mean I, I'm a sort of walking testimony myself because I'd always, always had a weight problem my entire life. It'd no, birth, well, literally. seriously, for um, those of you that can't see Katie, you would never, never know this. And Do you mind sharing how old you are? Uh, no, I am 40, I'm 50 this year. 50 this um, year, so, wow, where well, you yeah. look about 30, and so that's pretty good there going. There are photos up on, on my socials, because the, the the biggest problem I had, which is what got me into Qigong, was after I gave birth to my twins, I, I had an assisted pregnancy, which then, from my body saying, no babies at all, I forced it to have two, and I'm very grateful to the, the, the universe for having, letting me have them, but I was 20 stone when I came out of hospital, which is, which is fine, but it's not my When you came body. out... When, mm. After you'd had them, you were 20 stone. Yeah, I was 20 stone. And there's photos yeah. to show it. It's all on Instagram. Um, and the reality is, is that I, at that stage, didn't know this. And so I did the, I breastfed and did all of that. And when all that finished, and finally I'm like, oh my God, looking at the car wreck of, of my, because it doesn't matter whatever weight you are, but my normal weight was nine or 10. That was kind of where I used to yeah. be. So that yeah. was a big shift. Um, and the reality was that the calories in versus calories out method, which of course I immediately went into doing, I did some horrendous diet, loads of exercise, didn't work. No. Got me down to about 16 stone and I was there and thinking, okay, well this is fine, but it's not my normal body weight. It's not what I'm used to feeling like. Um, and that was when I started, because by this point I was a qualified Chinese medicine practitioner, so I'm like, right, come on, there must be something going on. Mm. And off I went to China, I was sort of speaking to people about different things, and then suddenly this sort of bubbled up out of nowhere. And I'm like, wow, hang on, what is this? And it took me ages to piece it all together. Because the thing about Qigong is that the animals is very much the sequence in Qigong, which is really sculpting. It's going to really give you like muscle tone, okay? And that work, mm. that works extremely well for me or for anybody whose bodies are quite resistant because yeah. many people's are, and that is what's going to do the trick. Whereas the softer end of Qigong never did it for me in terms of the outside. It got the inside absolutely strong, but but what got my body sort of sculpted and chiseled down from post baby in, yeah. in into this is <laughs> which still wow. I can actually I see you. You've you've popped back onto my screen now. This teeny oh. really itty bitty waist. That's what yeah, did it. Yeah, From 20 stone you, like, after having twins. Oh my goodness, you look yeah, like you're so, a size eight. So, so this bit now, and so this swimming dragon we were doing where you're basically, you're going like this, you're creating this S. Yeah. Around the middle. This is my absolute yeah. go-to exercise. So the, the thing is, is, my entire band has basically been created out of all my problems. <laughs> I've had so many of them. Yeah. <laughs> Which is why I know everything works. You know, I had... My skin was aging. You know, I, I wasn't born with some amazing gene pool. You know, I'm sort of born, you know, but what I've discovered is all this brilliant stuff, yes. which works. And you think, well, it's not like I'm some ex-supermodel, therefore everything's going to work on her because she's just born gorgeous. But yeah. when you're born normal and you've got to make the best of it, then you need a few tricks up your sleeve, don't you? And, you know, Gua Sha is the, top of, is the tip of the iceberg. Yeah, I love this. And Qigong is the iceberg. <laughs> okay, okay. So you would do, what would your routine be in the morning? Talk me through it. Would you get up and do your gua sha first? And then would you do your tapping uh, and your chicken? You Love to know. Share. I'll show you, actually, because I'm in my bathroom. So I'm just going to go for a little walk about this, and I'll show you exactly what I did. <laughs> so I'm, obviously I'm naked, which I won't, I won't, I won't, I'll spare you that. Detail. But this is where I have my shower. So the, so the first thing we do is we go in the shower. It's all about being quick. I won't put sure. the water on. I'll just, I'll just stand here. So... Oh, actually, hang on a minute. Oh, why do I talk to them? I'm glad you have that problem. I, I have oh, my, my two girls, honestly, when, when they're at home, I can't find anything. And then no, I go into their room and it's I, like, oh, that's where it is. Every live feed, when I'm like, where's that gone? So I stand here and I put the water on. So I'm the first thing I do is three big breaths down the plug hole because you want to get the stale air out of the voice. <sighs> so you, you exhale down the plug hole to expel it. I love that. Get all the bad stuff yeah. down the drain. <sighs> down the drain. And the thing is, Liz, this whole brand is about being practical. We're busy. I haven't got two hours. I've got about two minutes. Yeah. So I've got to give you something that in two minutes is going to work. So that's the first thing. Now, the next thing I do is I grab two of my cones, 
to write here. Yep. And then I do shower combing, okay, which is the world's best technique. So the first bit is you go around the middle like this. So Katie's shower combs look a little bit like this, but they've got little comb edges. You'll see them on her website. And then what are you doing? You're, you're, so you're, you're, you're doing around. here. Yep. In the shower. And what this is doing is it's working on a really important channel called the dimine, which is responsible for middle age spread. So Ooh. we're just alleviating the toxicity out of the middle, just about six weeks. Yeah. And then I change direction and I'm just clearing the channel like this. Yep. Just six weeks and then down the middle. Six weeks. So it's just basically abdominal massage. It takes about 30 seconds. Okay. And once I've done my tummy. Yeah. Then I move on to my legs. Okay. And I'll just move my camera down so everyone can see. And I take the same two combs, same water, just take the combs, and I'm just going down my legs like this. Da -da 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 -da. And okay. that's just going to bring up a bit of a red flush. Yeah. And what I'm doing is a, it's a Chinese massage technique called Tui Na. And what you're doing is you're doing something called dredging the channels. Okay. <laughs> and dredging the channels is, is clearing them from any toxicity that's been accumulating in there. And what the body does, when you've got toxicity in the body, guess what it does? It wraps fat cells around it. Cellulite, all of that. Yeah. Right. And the thing is that the further through life we go, more, more issues we've had to cope with, because that's what we do when you get older, especially as women, sure. is um, that's why you get middle-aged spread, because you're, if you're not releasing it, it gets stuck. And the nature of fat is it's cloying and sticky, which means calories in versus calories out does not work, because underneath that is a vibration of pain or something awful, something you have to deal with, that if you didn't process it at the time, the body would just envelop it and hold on to it, Ooh, and then you start spreading it, because it's tiny. So you need to release it. So you clear it. Clear it out. Yeah, Love that. Coming. Love that. Clearing out. And, and what a great time of year to be doing it now. Change of oh, seasons, yes, brand new year. Let's clear it all out. Get rid of all that bad stuff. Exactly. And, and all we've done is, is that whole thing that I've just shown you takes about one minute. Well, I mean, you're in the shower so anyway. The shower. So it's, it's not going to yeah. take any time. I'm so, so going to be breathing down the plug is. hole. If there's everybody else, I think. Oh, we love it. Well, it's all, this whole brand is about being efficient with tiny little snippets of time. I call it self-care snacking. Quite like that. Yeah, I um, love that. Because it's like, no, you know, we haven't got time to spend five hours a day. I mean, sure. I've got about five minutes. So, it's still in my shower. Then comes the beauty restorer under my eye, over my eye, with yep. the water on my face, breaststroke, 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 breaststroke. Mm -hmm. Now my face is all like ready to go. Yeah. Then I come out of the shower. Finished with a cold burst, so we're always making sure we're fluctuating cold. the temperature. Yeah, it's very important. We love a bit of cold. Yeah. And then out I come. By this point now, I've put my towel back on. Um, and then I come out here. And this is where you grab the tap. So now you get yourself dry. And yeah. now normal people are naked because they're not doing this on Instagram. So then you grab your tapper and you do the tapping that we were just doing. So yep. now just use your hand and then you tap all over the body. Yeah. To invigorate the energy, and this is like the toothbrush for energy, okay, it's like an energy brush. It's like you tap yourself all over, and you're now going to feel ready to start your day. You're totally energized, ready. relaxed, yet energized. Everything is geared up to go alert, relaxed, I mean, just in the zone, really. Exactly, and that's just, so that's a very simple two-minute morning routine which is, is now easy? dealing with body fat dealing with energy waking you up getting you getting your face re ready for makeup yep. and off you go i mean look i'm look i'm so pleased with gosh because i'm nearly 50 and i'm like it's amazing it i mean amazing. i don't need botox i mean people do it what they amazing. want to do but i love yeah. the fact that you don't that this is what you're going to get yeah if you do these techniques because they work there are so many things that we can do Katie, it's such a thrill to have you here. I want you, I want you again and again and again, every time we just learn so much. So remind us your website and your Instagram and everything that, and you know, where people can go to find you. Yes, so Hey You Fit is, um, is the website which has got all the Qigong on it, and there's a seven day free trial. Amazing. And then there's a 20% promotion with you guys, with Liz Loves, which gives you 20% nice. off if you want to subscribe to it. Fantastic, um, but you can try it for seven days for free. Yeah, for free.
great stuff. I know, it's really good. Great. So what I'd love to do, Liz, is to get you to try it with us. and then we'll, we'll I love it. I'm so on it, Katie. If, as long as the time zones work, because I'm three hours ahead, I am so yeah. with it. I'm, I'm in that mind now. It's the beginning of February. I was noticing yesterday was quite an auspicious day. I don't know what you think about this in Chinese medicine, but it was 020202. Two, two. <laughs> anyway, it was the 2nd of February yeah, 2022. Two, two, yeah. So, you know, in kind of numerology terms, that's quite a, a, a special moment in the calendar, isn't it? That, that, that was. It was Chinese New Year the day before, and mm. tomorrow is the first day of spring in the natural calendar and the beginning of the tiger year. One, one last thing to say about this tiger year, but every, even if you think, oh, I don't believe in that, just please be aware, because just because you don't believe in it, like, trust me, I can promise you it's moving. So... The tiger does not like to get caged, okay? She needs to move because she's a very athletic creature. Ooh. And you may well find if you're not doing exercise and stretching, it doesn't have to be Qigong, but just like stuff, okay? That you may well find yourself being more irritable than normal, more oh. more tense, more sort of stiffness because you're in a tiger year. And, and exercise is a very important thing to do in a tiger year because the, they need it. They're, they're, they're big power. Yeah, power sure. Features. Massive. These, yeah, super strong. Yeah. And they need space and they need to yes. move. Absolutely. So we as women need to be, cre mm. we need to be allowed to be creative. We need to be enabled to kind of come into our territory and come into our own and we need to move our bodies. Okay. It's a, those are my sort of things to leave you with, even if you don't want to do any more with it, that, that is something to recognize. If you suddenly find something, mm. oh my neck, what's going on? It's the tiger year. So just, just make sure you're doing your stretching and doing it, whatever it is, walking, qigong, exercising, as long as you're exercising, mm. it's going to help you. Um, and Liz, I think we need to uh, get a couple of teachers on with you or something so that you can really like put it through its paces. Definitely. I'm, I'm so signing up um, and we'll definitely connect um, after this because I'm massively inspired. I think it's, uh, it's just great and it's so easy and it's so doable. I can do it here in my bedroom. I don't need to, you know, leave or buy anything special. It's just, you know, it's all here. Well, thank you, because um, I put a lot of um, love into this, because yeah, I, I, I am also that woman. I'm also that busy yeah. woman with the kids and the life and the this and the that. And I'm like, how? <laughs> how do I do all this? Because we're now, as women, doing what our mothers did and what our fathers did. Yeah. And we're expected to look amazing. Um, yeah. And thanks to people like you, we do. Because well, I don't know about that, saying to you last time, your, your book, I remember, because you're just a tiny bit older than me. So when I was that sort of... A little bit older. You're very kind. I'm 18 years older than you. <laughs> well, you could be my daughter, you know, technically. Yes. I technically. Guess I could, technically. But no, you, look, you look so incredibly brilliant. But I'll never forget your first book. And it was like, it had pride of place on my bookshelf. But I did everything oh, you said. Literally everything. I remember you talking about sunbathing with, um, you had carrot oil or some kind of like, as protection. And I remember you, and you were the first person to talk about it. I was um, like, oh my God. Oh, I need to protect my skin. <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, it's, yeah, I have been doing it a long time, but it's it's just wonderful to connect with like-minded people that live it and breathe it. And, you know, I particularly love, yeah. you know, these, these midlife fab female founders. As you say, you live it and it works and you just want to share that and get it out there. And, you know, I'm exactly the same. You know, it's about inspiring and empowering others with simple things that actually do work. So... Yeah. Thank you. Well, they do. Well, thank you for having me. It's been such a pleasure to speak to you again. Oh, uh, you too, my lovely. Stay well, and I hope that we can connect yes. again very soon. And I hope I can see you moving next time. Um, yes. I, can, I, I, I can see you static, um, but I'm, I'm going to uh, to go through and watch again because we do save all of these, of course, these recordings. So I will be able to replay it and actually get the swimming dragon exactly right. Yes. <laughs> Or if you come over to my Instagram, which we're on right now, um, twice a week, Tuesdays and Thursdays, I do a free half-hour class. Which oh, I fantastic. So you might find that easy if you just go onto my IGTV. Just like, I mean, you get me chat, chat, Great. chat all the way through, obviously. <laughs> fantastic. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm there. Tuesdays and Thursdays. Yeah, have a look. Will do. Yes, what what, what time? Because yeah, that's when I do work. my lives. What time do you do those? Um... I'm doing, uh, well, the, the lives are at 8 till about 8.45. Oh, fine. Uh, but then that's they go good. onto IGTV. 
So, so I can catch up. So people watch a lot so of So live, yeah. 8, 9, 10, 11. Yeah, that would work. I'd be able to do it just before mine, my live. So yeah, that would be good. That would put me in a good frame of cool. mind. Well, let us know. Well, thank you so much. I'll let you go. Thank you so thank much you. for having me. And thank you everyone for joining. Lovely to Lots see you, love. darling. Thank you. You too. You, too. You, you, you click off so that I don't um, disconnect everybody. Oh, wasn't that great? Did you enjoy that? Oh, absolutely. I mean, just fantastic. Really, really good. Yeah, I'm totally, I'm going to check out her YouTube channel as well. Brilliant. And they don't clash the times. Excellent. I have actually, talking about YouTube, I've just loaded up a new video that I filmed here when I was at the coast. That's going up today. So if you're not following the Lazar Wellbeing YouTube channel, make sure you are. Those of you who are already watching on YouTube, a big hi. And thank you for all your comments. We really do appreciate them. Now, before I go, just to say, I uh, had an, a massive response to the live that I did with Tim Samuels on, was it Tuesday? I lose track of time here. Talking all about Calm Assist. Oh my goodness, if you haven't watched that, do please go back and watch it. Talking about nutrigenomics and harnessing the powers of clinically proven herbs and spices like saffron, ashwagandha, cherry, uh, to combine with other nutrients like magnesium, zinc, B vitamins, etc. And I have been traveling through Kenya with them. And the two that Tim was particularly talking about for himself were mood. He's been very vocal and open about talking about depression, um, particularly in men. And uh, I'm actually recording a podcast with him tomorrow, actually. So I'm really looking forward to, to recording and hearing more about all of that. But he takes mood and immunity because he's getting over COVID. So really interesting herbs. Go and check out their website. They've got two amazing research scientists, a Harvard Medical School pr professor and a nutritional psychiatrist uh, who's based at Stanford University. So that's really interesting. And the two that I have been taking, I, took, I had such a good night's sleep last night. I had the relax formula. Um, and then I've also uh, been taking energy just because I've been traveling around and I just kind of want a bit of get up and go. That's the one with maca root. So lots of great things. Go, You can explore those just like Katie and Hey You. We have 20% off Calm Assist if you want to give it a try. Definitely worth a go. Just use Liz Loves. It's the usual one. Um, and the other one, just to remind you of, which I know you all love, and I've been taking it, so I just wanted to give them another great shout out because they're so generous in continuing with their discount for us, because I know so many of you rely on this now, is the Ingenious Beauty Collagen. And this is the one, this is their new one, and this is the one that I now take. It's called Ingenious Active, and it's got the orange top. And this also, Katie will be interested in this, this has a blend of Chinese herbs within it, alongside the amazing collagen and the astaxanthin and the hyaluronic acid. So it's uh, the collagen, the astaxanthin and the hyaluronic acid for the skin and then the blend of Chinese herbs that they have clinically proven. Again, this is very much um, pharma nutrient uh, research evidence based to help with exercise, recovery, muscle mass, tone, all about that. So just really, really good. What's that, Charlie? You were going to say you didn't know whether to get the Safra Sun or the Mood. Well, I think I have the Safra Sun here and I was really impressed with what uh, Kevin Levers at the Naked Pharmacy was talking about inflammation specifically. Um, I think if you're looking for something to pick up a mood, then maybe the Mood formulation that's got uh, saffron in it with other things. But for sheer anti-inflammatory power, then the Natraflex, you know, looking at joints, inflammation, aches, pains. I think I shared with you that I get tension headaches sometimes, particularly if I'm hunched over a computer screen writing and I get so absorbed in research that, you know, my body kind of just becomes really rigid. Um, and usually ibuprofen is the only thing that works for me, the anti-inflammatory. And Kevin was explaining how the Natraflex uh, can be more powerful yet gentler. So worth having a look at the evidence. That's Naked Pharmacy. And I'm, I know that we do have a discount with them. Let me just check. I've just um, dropped my screen there. But Naked Pharmacy, where are you? Have so many. Honestly, if ever you want to know what the discounts are, um, please go to lizardwellbeing.com. And if you just simply search Liz Loves, you will see them all up there. It, my page isn't loading. Sorry, I'm a fairly sure that it is, um, is it 15%? I think it is here, there we go. Where are we? Gosh, there's so many great things, including Holistic Silk. I've got my lovely eye mask. 
from there. Where are we? L M N bed of nails. Yeah, I've got my nail bed. Neil's yard. Yep, fifteen percent off all of them. Naked pharmacy, twenty percent. Okay, so lots of twos today. Twenty percent off. Katie and her Hey You Qigong, but of course you can get the seven day free trial. Go for it. Literally go for it. I will see you in her classes. 20% on your Calm Assist. Lots of different formulations there. Relax, immunity, energy, mood. 15% um, on your Ingenious Active and 20% on your um, Naked Pharmacy. So that brings us to the close of today. Just to say I am indeed wearing Asquith. Bamboo. I love this so much. This is my favourite cami. I don't know whether you can see at the back. Can you see? I just love this shape. And it's got kind of like a built-in bra, so it's really supportive. I've had this one for so long, and they are really, really well made. It's a fantastic female-founded British brand. Love it. Super good investment. Um, go and check those out. We also have a 15%. Liz loves with them as well, so what is not to love? And then if you wanted to download your exercise guide the stronger slimmer you there we are a bargain 4.99 it's online but you can print it out if you want to like i've got because that's got lots of recipes in it as well if you're looking perhaps to switch away from high carb high sugars a bit more healthy fats a bit more keto maybe it's all in that guide as long as some of the exercises just to say we do have a few of the subscription gifts left this came with me in my luggage. I absolutely love it. I'm going to be using it tonight. It's the Deep Sleep Lifesaver Overnight Treatment for Hair. And it has got not only the most amazing essential oils in it, but it's also got cashmere protein that soaks into your hair. So if your hair is a bit thin, fine, lacklustre, I absolutely love it. I'm going to be doing it tonight. And that's £32.50 normally because it's quite a big one, you can see. But it's free. Free if you subscribe to Lizelle Wellbeing Magazine, just take out your direct debit, either for you or for a friend. You can have the gifts sent to you if you want them to get the magazine or vice versa. Just let the lovely people at Warners know. And that brings me neatly on to say that I'm very excited that next Tuesday, which is my next live, so now I'm live on Tuesdays and Thursdays, I'm going to be joined by Michael Van Clark. Yes, the amazing British hairdresser, award-winning creator of this fantastic brand. It's actually called Three More Inches. And we're going to be finding out exactly what he means by Three More Inches. Um, and it's saying naturally rebuilds every strand for longer, stronger, healthier, glossier hair. Who doesn't want that? Anyway, so next week, next Tuesday, is going to be all about hair. So if you've got hair questions, please pop them in the comments. However you're watching us, Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, pop a comment in the questions and we will make sure that they all get picked up um, and then my team will pass them on to me and then I will relay those for a wonderful live chat with Michael Van Clark across the airwaves. So that's it for today. Um, I am... As I say, back on YouTube, if you want to download or take a look at my new film that's going up, that's a, an exercise snack, something that I always travel with, with a couple of handy hacks, which you might like at the moment. And then tomorrow, there is a brilliant, brilliant podcast, if you're watching me in real time tomorrow, which is Friday, with Lucinda Miller, the naturopath, talking about pans and pandas OCD, compulsive behaviour, tics, eating disorders, long COVID, inflammation of the brain. I mean, it's completely fascinating. She is just brilliant. She's one of my favourite people. I've had her before on my podcast. Um, you are going to absolutely be riveted. Please take a listen. Make a note in your diary. Set an alarm. Make sure you're subscribed to the Liz Our Wellbeing Show podcast. Um, my brand new series, the main show, which goes out on Wednesdays, started yesterday and there was a really good interview with Catherine Pinkham talking about insomnia and sleep. So if you're having trouble sleeping, maybe insomnia has been a lifelong thing for you, do please take a listen because she's very, very insightful in what she has to say. So that's the start, episode one of our brand new series. I think we're in series nine now, my goodness. We've had something like nearly four million downloads. It's amazing. So thank you very much for all your comments on that, particularly on iTunes, really appreciated. So wherever you listen to your podcasts, you'll find that. So any of the platforms, Spotify, iTunes, Acast, you can download it direct from the web whenever. And then the new one, the Friday Five, which is my weekly one, that will go up live tomorrow, as will, of course, our newsletter, 
My goodness, it doesn't stop, does it? So every Friday we send out a newsletter. If you want to subscribe, that comes into your inbox at around tea time, UK time. And that is just filled with great things. All the things that we've been doing during the week, ideas for the weekend and the week ahead, special offers, competitions, links to podcasts, you name it, it's all in the newsletter. Oh, well, I think I'm on a roll. It must be all that Qigong. I feel like I've got new batteries. I feel like the Duracell bunny. I just want to carry on and on and on. Must be all my, I don't know, everything that, you know, maybe one of my, well, I did take my energy formula. So maybe it's the combination of that and Qigong. Anyway, I'm so looking forward to signing up to Katie's platform. Please make sure that you do too. Try it out. Seven days free. What's not to love? And then if you do love it, then you can use your Liz Loves to get 20% off your first month. I shall see you there. Have a lovely rest of the week. And I'll be back live next Tuesday. But tune in to all the other channels. Meantime, sending you lots of love. Bye-bye. Hearts back. Thank you. Bye-bye.